What is up? It was already spun on two reporting back in after like three tries of getting footage shot. Mm. Anyways, after those three times I might actually be able to get this posted on YouTube if it doesn't have that processing error. Anyways, we are watching Zero Black Lightning Zero. I did feature his replay a while back when he was in the Ferdinand once upon a time, and I have no idea what he's doing right now. Yep. Chatting. Okay. And the new vision is what's going on. I'm not going to criticize him for that because this is a mastery replay. Uh, I kind of want this tank, but I just don't have the will to grind it. Takes a hit. I don't know if I'm painting. Oh, this Alf hands are in the back being a scrub. Good shot. Uh, yeah. Now our friend here is uh, put on the back, but quite easily. This K91 is always going to pen him. But he has a good HE shot on the PC. I don't have one of the shots, so... This camera is going all over the place. Nice finishing shot off on the BC-25T. Uh oh, this more kicking the B1 is going to eat it. is going to kill me. I'm going to waste some actual finishing off the K91. That's sad. Hmm, still on spawn, but it's at 2.7k damage. I mean, it's not bad for a guy who's been sitting and spawned the entire match. If you can hear my cat on the mic, I'm sorry. He is very, uh, needy on the attention. Let's see, 3.3k damage done and spawned the entire time. I, I'm surprised I wouldn't have been able to do that much and won't live that long. It's a 2 on 2 right now. I, anyways, this IS-6 is probably gonna bite the dust rather quickly here. Yeah, he bit the dust. Ooh, there's a grill. Oh, he's eating the grill. He's eating. He's just waiting for the grill to poke out. Currently he's backing up, which is a... When you, when you back up like this, you make it so that they have to poke out to get a shot at you. AT shot on the grill. I wouldn't have hit that. Trying to get the high ground right here, but the Aguru is not known to be good at Kenobiing. Slow roll though. That's a really low roll. Now he's just gonna face the steel up and he fought it up. I mean, it's a smart move, I guess. Considering that. Have armor. He doesn't have one to blow the ground. And a good shot. Wonderful. Wonderful. Alright, so look at this. We have a mastery. We have a top gun. We have a high caliber. We have a Bradley Bradley Walters. Oh, I can't talk. Uh, 4.6 KEXP divide 3,081 by 2, you're getting around 1.4, well, 1.04 KEXP, I guess. 
I'm not good at doing math on the spot. Anyways, we have 5.8k damage, 40,000 credits, and 5 killed. Incurring Radley Walters. Uh, pretty good carry match, 3k above second place. It's not bad. Excuse me as I get my cat off my computer desk. Okay. Our enemy team did decently, I guess. I mean, teams lately have been sucky. They always have been. Uh, efficiency, 775, 918, K91 had 1.64, 0.64K done. I think that's all we need to know. Uh, credits, 40,000, EXP is relatively good for uh, quote-unquote first game of the day. Awards, pretty basic awards. Mousetrap, I like that. Alright, now we're going to view some of mine. Um, I only have three replays for you, though. I have all these, but that would lead to processing error, because it just does. Normandy, let's go. Hmm. You're in the O1K right now. Which is my favorite tank in the game. The last new one. Hey, just you can do the job in it if you play it right, and it rewards good playstyle. Which is all I need. So on Normandy we have a team of seven. Why do I say team of seven? Because half the time you get someone to heal looking and then they get deleted. I Revenge 07, 07, right? I can't believe I return the gesture in the battle. Do I? No, no. Oh, I'm disappointed. When I said dude, I was talking to the BC 25T, who basically you know, was shot by the Sheridan 577. Not necessarily a bad role to take on, but certainly. See, we have five tanks on this one against our, looks like, three. This M103 is just sat on the back of the back of the Like in the AMX, am I gonna get the AMX? I get a shot at this chief, and he backs up, but I'm shoot the AMX. Uh, I feel like a scrub right now. Take a shot from the team. Uh, running away, running away, running away. I have nothing better to do. We see on the way. I'm going to stand the standard B right there. I could HE. But I won't get a chance. Try to back up. Back up into it. Rotation. 17 degrees of turret rotation per second, which is terrible, but it's super heavy as well, so. Chief Jenny, he's finishing off. He's finished off. Go back to the garage, please. I don't appreciate British Chief Jenny's school. Well, unless I'm the chief, then, but you don't have to make sacrifices. The shot flew wide on that BK-45 or 2B. Unfortunately. I am currently pushing the standard of which I successfully did to my bewilder. But he also got caught on a bunker. AG just shot that gives me the green light to push him. I put the shot on the deck right there to get the shared line. 
I've got a good 10 seconds to uh, get better. Oh no, there's a bat shadow me. Oh no. This is good. Doesn't really matter what pen anyways. There's Sheridan is all that's left now. And it's a pretty simple finish from here. I assume he's gonna go over into his spawn because why would you go over to your other base when you know there are gonna be enemy players on the other base? Oh look, but he's at his spawn. So I was right. Screws up that agent. simple, he just gets deleted by our uh, other two teammates. Teammates, they just need lags. Shh, it's fine. They're just here being shields. It's fine. Oh look, Sheridan's dead. Alright, let's exit. 4.2k damage, a second class, steel ball. Spartan. Overall, pretty solid game for a tank that only has 2.4k average damage per minute. Uh, Chieftain, blah, 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 blah. Credits. I hate credits, surprisingly enough. EXP, pretty standard EXP for that kind of game. Type of game. Desert Sands. Let's go to this one. I did get two maps recently, 7201K recently. I don't know if I saved them though. And I don't want to waste the time on film just trying to look for them. So if I find them, I will make a separate video for you. And that's if I can upload this one. If you don't, you won't be seeing videos from me. For a while until I can figure out what's wrong with my uploader. I think it's just a microprocessing error because the computer I'm running is like four years old and it's not very good at running top of the end clients. So Ron doesn't understand we're pushing A at the moment. My blind shot over there. I do not think it's successful though. If it was, that would have been cool. I have plenty of targets I can shoot. I'm gonna go with the C75. And then I take one point EK and turn just for uh, sitting there. That was from the waffle and the grill though. So I'm not surprised. That's fine, I still put 402 into the room, which is pretty, pretty sizable roll. But now I have to put myself on the back foot because I am running low on HP into the first minute of the second game. So, we don't need to go put it down to an effect of one shot, but one of the big gun and shoot HP. Fosh could finish him off with a high roll with the lucky. But no, I'm gonna try and finish off the grill right here now. Yeah. 2.7 2.7 damage, two minutes into the game. Fairly effective. I'm looking at this wall for the majority of key shot on it. That's what this tank is good at. It's, a, it's something that you like to put on hills and just engage from the side. Like you're at, it's actually surprising how many bounces you can get if you just rotate it slightly. So 
special as overall it's a pretty solid game it's not something I'd send into like a professional youtuber though I would send it to, like a mastery or something but hey I mean it's, it's a solid game and then we have Falls Creek I do believe I got a mastery on Port Bay I'd have to find it for you I believe I have it. Oh, here it is. This is it. And then you're gonna watch any of this. If you don't skip this. No, it's not it. Yeah. I know I have it. Oh, it's this one right here. Oh, my word, it's not. Where is it? Technical difficulties, please stand by. It's this one. This is it. I know it is because there's an E100 at the end. Alright. We're gonna watch this one, then we'll go back into my favorite selection. And I'll see if that last replay is one of the masters. If it isn't, we'll just end the video right now and there. So, I do want to clear something up. Uh, let's, let's think about this real quick. I have not uploaded in about three and a half, four weeks now. And the reason being, I lost all of my content that I put into YouTube or had saved due to bad timing. I was gonna film a video once, when, but then Gravity Mode came and all my replays just went away. Two, because the microprocessor on my computer didn't process the video correctly and it was very very bad graphic wise. I'm not sure why. It might have just been due to the fact that I had to update the video processor, but that wouldn't make any sense because it was passively updates. And three, because you would not accept this because they were either too long or too short. Regardless, if I am able to post this, I do want to let y'all know. Due to school starting around three days for me, I am not going to be posting any videos for a while until I can figure out how to improvise the schedule to fit YouTube videos in. be a very tight schedule to put it into. But, that aside, this should be fairly easy to understand. Anyways, back to the replay, we have an IS-7, a Waffle Tracker, an Optics and a 4, and a Musketeer. Mm, not good. Not good. That's not good. All four. I'm gonna push up this bridge right here, I'm gonna try and attack the Waffle Tracker and the IS-7. 
Uh, if you do get the Star Wars reference right here, this is right here. you're gonna isolate your targets, and then you're gonna duel them one on one because that's what this tank is supposed to do. It's supposed to attack a target one on one, clear him, move on. Because if you engage multiple targets at once, you're just gonna get wrecked because they're gonna circle you, and you can only have your forward plate facing one. So at this point, it's just face on this iron seven submission because he cannot have it for his life. When you're in this tank and you're face up, you have to make sure you put your gun down and shake your turret wherever you have a part under the turret which the mantlet does not touch, and they can shoot that part in the turret. Finishes off the IS-7, luckily enough for me. I, I would have been dead if didn't finish him off. And... He's dead. He's dead. We're rocking 6k right now. Which I mean... Pretty good, pretty good. This C100 is going to run back to the spawn. This is why it came up here, because I thought he was going to go down. But he wasn't there when he's run back to the spawn. I don't know why, though. I mean, nobody really did. I think he was running back there as like a tactical retreat. Irregardless, he's going to lose this match anyways, because he can't get all the bounces that he needs, the E100 cannot do that much bounces. It's not a mouse, it's an E100. So the parking right here, bring a nice 671 roll into him, bringing him down to an effective two shot. E100 pokes around with a 513 roll into him, and I can see him on the C46. 7k right there. And a mastery. Wunderbar. Uh, about 5k more than the top second damage done in the match. I, mean, I, I guess that's a small carry. I say small generously. Uh, fairly good damage all around. I mean, I bullied the crap out of Isaiah 7. Credits, made credits, EXP, made EXP, awards, I got rewards. Alright, I'm going to end the video right here because I am approaching 25 minutes and I believe that is the gating for my microprocessor. <clears throat> I wish I could show you the false freak, but I can't. Sorry. Uh, I can't make a second video if you want. You're going to have to leave comments though. Anyways, I have about a minute and a half left to address things that need to be addressed. So, let's see here. Uh, where do I start? I am currently not doing any active grinding right now. I am I gave up on the Gunnarvin like a week ago. I haven't sold it yet. Uh... I recently bought the Kong Panzer 70, which is the equivalent of a German Abrams. Um, I have the Chieftain, I have the 50B, I have the 72 Owen, I have the E5. Oh, that reminds me. Uh, I am going to be creating a Discord server soon for any of you viewers who would like to have your content featured because I have not received over five uh, complimentary replays for me to post into the videos. I've only received two in fact, and that was from a friend of mine. His replay was featured first, by the way. Yeah. So, in that Discord server, you will be able to A, see me live stream, if I am able to live stream, uh, uh, post replays or platoon with me if you like and I'll, I'll be filming those tunes live. 
However, that is all up to you if you want to join the new server or not. It's not going to be that big. Anyways, that is it. There's already a small one too. Out.